Good afternoon, everyone. Today is Labor Day, Monday, September 1st, day 93 of this birthday quest. And today's birthday quest theme is going out to John. John is now the fourth member of the powerful IU Bass Studio to be featured in this birthday quest. And I talk about that studio quite a bit in the day 22 video. John's a super great guy. He's one of the most dependable people that you meet, great musician, and also very funny as well. After getting his undergrad, performance diploma, and master's degree in double bass performance, he then goes and gets his degree in law, and he's currently practicing just a few hours away from my home city. We got to work together a lot during my time at IU, but one of my most memorable moments in my entire four-year life at IU came when I conducted a composition that he wrote, which is one of the last compositions I conducted at IU. This is a story that I first referenced in day 20 of this birthday quest. John was taking a composition class, and at the end of the semester, the students had their pieces performed in front of the rest of the class. So I came by one day to conduct several pieces, and the piece that John composed was written for string trio and hand manualist. Hand manualist, by the way, is a more sophisticated way of describing a hand farter. I can't do it. <laughs> this piece starts out like a fugue. It's quasi broke, and it comes with the subject bum 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 ba 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 bum bum bum. Then you have the answer bum 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 bum. <laughs> then the third instrument comes in, and then finally, <laughs> <laughs> to this day, it is one of the funniest musical moments in my lifetime. The class was just rolling, the teacher was rolling. It was just a grand old time. Alas, as far as I know, no recording exists of that debut performance in the class, but I will put a link to that sample MIDI recording that John did. For John's birthday quest theme, I ended up using the letters of his last name through my musical alphabet code number two to generate material for the theme. Then I noticed that the opening material that that generated was very similar to a slightly obscure bass quote from the orchestral repertory, and I used that in the second half of the theme. As always in the birthday quest, all quotes are played in the original keys that they were written, but their rhythm and surrounding harmonies are different. All you need to do is check the information section below the video on the YouTube page to see what the quote is. Happy birthday, John. I hope you're doing well, my friend. And I'm actually going to be down in your neck of the woods later this season, so let's get together for a catch-up. 